Once again, I welcome you to my channel. Yes, my name is Nia, aka Ganyabi. I need to share this to my people. It's all about Ghana. And today I'm here at, um, I think East Legon. Yes, um, somewhere around Lume Street, close to Kingsford University. Um, I'm here for an exhibition. And this exhibition is being done by a world renowned top Ghanaian photographer called James Bano. Um, is a photographer, he's a top-notch photographer who started way back when Ghana was then good coast. And um, there's an exhibition going on here. But guys, you know I can't do this without you. Please don't forget, if this is your first time coming on my channel, don't forget to subscribe, like, and then share some comment with me. So let's go in there and see what we have. Okay, see you guys. Here alone, I came with one, one of my friends, and um, I know most of you might have seen her already on my channel. The female photographer and filmmaker, yes, that's her. Uh, I came to her. say hello to my people. Uh, you see, did you feel me off? <laughs> All right, so what's, what's your take here after seeing some few things? What can you say? I'm refreshed. To see um, stills from 1950s, 1960s, 70s, 80s. It's really refreshing to see um, these pictures from years before you were born. <laughs> <laughs> it's so interesting and it helps you to see the beauty of our culture and things that were before you came. And I'm really, really grateful for being here. I'm glad. I hope you are enjoying yourself. I am. Yeah, and you are learning something too, right? I am. Yeah, um, I'm inspired. I'm going to take my documentary photography series. Very I'll be serious. reading on the street. And I'll bring you know? Yes, to come. Yeah. It works me uh, more to you or to the world than you. So take pictures, take films, encourage people to go more into it and then document things that years to come will live on. Thank you. She's a, she's an influencer in the uh, 
female. Fem, female photography and videographer. So we see what she say. Maybe for you the know, males. Yeah. I don't want to be gender biased. <laughs> I, I, I love right. guys, so I want to teach you all. all right, so Thank you. Just stay tuned. Eh? I'll bring you more. I'm Abraham Kete. Abraham Kete. Yep. Oh, okay. God and we. God and we. All right. Okay. See you. Um, welcome to my channel. Thank you. And um, can you just brief us a little what's going on here? What's the name of this place? Okay, so um, this is Nubuki Foundation. Okay. Yeah, it was founded by Odeo Tevi, mm -hmm. Kofi Setoji, and uh, Tutu Ajari. Okay. Yeah, in 2006. Okay. So Nubuki is an organization and ground for recording, preserving, and promoting Ghana and contemporary arts. Okay. So um, James Bano is now a widely recognized photographer, pioneering photographer. So determined and dedicated, Bano became the first photographer at the inception of the Daily Graphic oh. in 1950. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So taking innovation is in his stride, Bano moved to London in 1959 mm -hmm. to develop his, his practice and he returned to Ghana a decade later okay. to establish the first color photo processing laboratory for sick Hegmeyer and a place of his own. That's Studio X23 okay. in Accra. Yeah. yeah. So every image that you see in here serves as an artifact of his um, philosophy to celebrate and capture life. Yeah. So the works in here has been um, reflected. Um, the, the works in here has been grouped into eight themes. So we have the family affair, okay. we have the governance and order, mm -hmm. we have the sports, mm -hmm. we have the muses, mm -hmm. iconic community, rhythm, and then young at heart. Wow. Yeah. I see. So are these, all, are these pictures also being sold if someone wants to sell them? Yeah, so they are sold. We have a copy. Let me get that. Okay. So, yeah. so this is a sample. Oh, okay. Yeah. So this is how you sell it? Is it a canvas or just? No, this is um, a silver print. Silver print? Yeah. Oh, okay. So silver. how much like this? this so the price depends on the picture or the size? On the size and then the addition of mm -hmm. the photo. Oh, okay. Yeah. So if anyone wants it, the person comes in, mm -hmm. you show the addition you want, the size, and then okay. you know your price. Wow. That's really interesting. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Uh, we we'll just go around tour the place and see some of the sure. pictures. All right. All right. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. And one thing I'm also excited about is that it's not just a gallery that you come and see pictures. James Bann also has a photo book. A photo book with his works in here. And I think the price is just 270 cities. I encourage everyone to order for a copy. You have all these pictures in here with the works, so you can place your order and yeah, it's a nice way to support him. So Come and enjoy good pictures. Thank you. So, um, it's been an awesome time being here. The pictures here, the education, getting to know something new, how the pictures relate to. And most, there's one particular picture where I know the venue that the picture was taken. I know the places in Palladium. One day I might bring a video, a story on that. Thank you so much for being around to see all these things and I'm so happy to have you watch this video. Thank you so much. And we, we, we are done with everything and we are signing off. Anytime you come to Ghana for the first time and you really want to have a picture or something that relates to Ghana that can take you back, back, way, way, way back, 
please don't hesitate to come here and also have a look at these pictures. They are so, it's free, like you don't pay anything. You just come here and see for yourself. So please, anytime you, you are in Ghana, just pass around and I have a look, okay? So thank you so much. If this is your first time and you find my content, uh, my channel to be interesting, please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and also comment down below. And let me know your thoughts. What do you think about this place? I see you next time on my episode. I say, Ghana to the world. Ola Bawa.